Hey guys, Stefan here, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to give you my top 10 best budget photo books under $20. In the past months, I did several top five videos, top five lay flat photo books, uh, smartphone photo books, and so on. And these videos were mostly focusing on mid-priced and expensive photo books. So I thought it's high time for me to do a video about the lower end of the price spectrum, the more affordable and budget photo books. Because let's face it, not all of us want to spend hundreds of dollars on photo books and sometimes all you need is a small gift for someone, uh, a small book about a party or somebody's new baby and you just want to give uh, a small gift to somebody and these books are all perfect for that purpose. So these are the books I'm going to be talking about today. It's quite a few here. So let's start with a few disclaimers as usual to make things absolutely clear and transparent. Number one, this is not an ad in any sense. I was not paid to do this video and I wasn't asked to pick any specific books into this selection or list. However, some of these books were sent to me for free, so I just wanted to disclose that before I go on. Everything in this video is based on my personal honest opinion. The books come in no specific order, so number one is not necessarily the best and the last one is not the worst. I just had to start somewhere, but as you'll see, these books are so different that you can't really put them into one to ten. They are all for a different purpose. And finally, the prices mentioned in this video are valid today on the 24th of May 2019 and they are valid for the indicated sizes and options. If you order these books at a different date with different upgrades and options and you find a different price, do not blame me. Let's start with the first one, which is going to be the photo books by Adorama Picks. Now this is an American company, if you don't know them. They cater for professional photographers. All of their photo books are lay flat and all of them are printed using a silver halide true photographic method. Now these books are obviously very expensive, but the one book you can get is the soft cover lay flat book, which is eight by eight inch square, and it comes with 20 pages, and it's completely lay flat, photographic, and amazing colors. This is the size of the book. It's an eight by eight inch book. Mine is hardcover because I did an upgrade, but instead of that, you're going to get a soft cover, an image wrap soft cover, and as you can see, these are the kind of templates that Adorama Pix is offering you in its online editor. It looks really, really good and I loved everything about this book. The colors were beautiful and um, it's perfectly lay flat. And um, as you can see, the colors are very nice, accurate and natural. So why choose this one if you want the best quality under $20, then this is the perfect book for you. It's $19.99 at the moment. So go for it and give it a go. Number two is chat books. Uh, I reviewed all of these books, by the way, before. So if you want to see my separate reviews are going to be uh, included in the description below. This is just a list. I'm not reviewing these books right now. I'm just talking about what you can get under $20. So chat books is a concept book as far as I'm aware, they were the first ones to introduce subscription style books. So how it works is you have to connect to your Facebook or Instagram account and Chatbooks is going to pull the pictures from those accounts and you can set up a subscription, which means that after every certain amount of pictures, I think it's every 60 pictures, they are going to create a book for you automatically and it will be delivered to your door every so often whenever you fill up a 60 page book. It's a great idea for those of you who post lots of pictures on Instagram and Facebook and don't have the time to edit photo books and go through the uh, checkout process and so on. So you can just set up the subscription and wait for your books to come. The good thing is you don't have to worry about how it's going to look because chat books are extremely simple. The book is the exact same all the way through, so you can have one photo per page. And there are three things that you can add to each page. One is a geotag where the picture was taken. You can add the comments and you can also add the date. So these things are optional. You can take them away, you can leave them on. I left on the, the geotag and the comments but I took off the date. And then the whole book is gonna be like that. So as you can see, just one picture per page. This one was created from Instagram. Obviously, if you don't want to create a subscription, you can do a one-off book like I did with this one. So you can create the book from the same accounts, but you can select which photos you want to be included and you can edit it yourself. This book here is the six by six inch hardcover version. But for $15, you can get the 8x8 inch, which was the size of the Adorama Picks book. 
um, and it's going to be 36 pages long with a soft cover finish. If you want to upgrade for your hardcover finish, it's going to be an extra $5, but still you would fit into your $20 budget. So an 8x8 inch book from Chet Books is going to cost you $15, 36 pages on a nice uh, silky 150 GSM paper. It's a digital book, so the colors are not going to be as amazing as in other armor picks, but it's certainly a good, really cool book with a nice concept behind it. Number three is an amazing company called Free Prints. They have uh, photo books and prints as well. How it works is every month you can get a free seven by five inches size soft cover 20 page photo book. And when I say free, it is actually free. So you don't have to pay for the book. All you have to pay is the postage, which obviously you have to pay for every single book uh, that I mentioned here. That's not included in the price if I forgot to mention that. So you can have one of these books for free every single month and the good thing about that is that it's a smartphone app and it's extremely easy to create these books and if you look through the templates they are actually quite nice and varied so it's not just one picture per page and you have lovely layouts and all kinds of uh, options that you can put text on and masks like uh, circular masks and things like that. So given that it's a free book, uh, I think it's, it's a very good quality product. The print quality is the same as with all other digital books. So it's very good, a glossy soft cover. If you want to upgrade, you can upgrade for a hard cover. You can upgrade for glossy high gloss pages. And I think there are a few more upgrades, but even if you do those, it's still going to be less than $20. Uh, bear in mind that there is a separate app for every single country. So the one I linked here, I think is the UK version. But if you go onto the Apple Store or what's it called, the Google one, Google Play Store, then I think depending on where you are, it's going to pull you the specific app for that country. Hope that makes sense. Number four is, again, a concept book, which is My Social Books. Now, as the name says, these are created from social media accounts. You can get one of these books for $19. The guy who came up with this book had a really great idea because um, this is something that has not been on the market before. And even since then, nobody else has tried to replicate this book. As you can see, there are many photo books which can take pictures from your Facebook account or Instagram account, but all they do is take the picture or maybe some comments, but they don't actually print your feed and your whole Facebook history. However, what this company does is they connect to your Facebook account, or Instagram account, and it basically gives you a printed physical version of your whole account, starting with your profile page, the pictures, every single post, status update, pictures you uploaded, comments that you got on them. And the good thing about it is that it's all automated, so you don't have to do anything really. All you have to do is connect your account and then press create the book. So anyway, this is how the book looks. Let me show you. It starts with a matrix of all of your pictures and then in the beginning is going to show what profiles the book was generated from. The good thing is that you can create a book from up to four separate profiles. So if you want to create a book with you and your partner's profile or your whole family, um, you know, your parents and your sister, then you can create the book from everybody's profiles combined. So I created this book from my and my sister's profile and then you can see the two people's profiles and then a uh, little content and then it's going to show that everything that's blue is going to be my stuff and everything that's pink is going to be my sister's posts so that's the first page you can see the profile pictures and then the posts uh, start coming and as you can see it shows you the date here in the top and it's basically just like going through your facebook and you can see the the comments you can see how many people liked each post and picture and so on. So it's basically a full um, transcription of your Facebook account. There are certain upgrades for paper quality and um, finish. You can choose from quite a few templates for the, for the front cover. But as I said, you cannot manually adjust the insides of the book. So you can't take out certain posts and move them around on the page. It's fully automated. So that's all about it. My social books, $19. And there is a code that you can use, uh, TPB Guru, and you're going to get 20% off your order. So it should work out around $15 for any of these books. Obviously, the more pages you have, the more expensive it's going to be. Number five is Mixbook. Now, who doesn't know Mixbook? I've 
talked about them so many times. It's one of the biggest photo book companies in the world and they have one of the best photo book editors in the world. When you go on and you try to create a photo book, you can do it in 10 minutes and it's always going to look amazing. It's drag and drop. They've got hundreds of templates that you can choose from. Obviously their photo book range is quite big. They have landscape books and hardcover, softcover and so on. A book for every single occasion, whether it's a graduation, Mother's Day, travel, baby, anything you want, you can find it. The cheapest one you can get is an 8.5 by 8.5 inch square soft cover book, which is going to be 19.99, and that's for 20 pages. And again, it's a digital book on 150 GSM standard silk paper. However, Mixbook is one of those companies that has a sale on every single week. So the sale goes up to 50% off, but you're always going to get at least 35% off. So the price of this book really is $12.99. And if you want to go for a hardcover version, it's going to be $19.49. So let me show you the kind of uh, templates that you can get. So that's one of the books from Lisbon. And these are all templates from Mixbook. I didn't have to create them, they were there. All I had to do was drag and drop my photos and uh, add some text. So that's how they look. Amazing, amazing. And here is another one, which is a hardcover version if you want to upgrade. So it's a nice hardcover with a dust jacket. And this one is quite a thick book from my Asia trip. And you can see the templates are just as amazing and you can do lovely pages like that. Number six is Motif. Motif is the new official um, substitute for Apple. As you know, Apple went out of business and then uh, several companies started reprinting their photo books and Motif is one of them. They are official in the sense that they used to be the suppliers of Apple before. So the book is completely identical to Apple. Every single material, the size and the pricing is the same as Apple used to be. So if you if you love your Apple books, then you're going to love the Motif books. The only difference is the editor. So the editor is not going to offer the same templates as Apple used to offer. The good thing is if you don't like their editor, you can still create your books in photos, Apple photos, export the book in a PDF format, import it into Motif, and they're going to print it on the same materials as Apple used to print. So you can get an Apple book from Apple templates, but printed by Motif, if that makes any sense. That's how it looks. Um, so that's just some of the templates. These are templates from the, let me try to page this properly. These are templates from the Motif editor, not from the Apple template. I think they still look really, really funky and it's a fun editor to use. It's very easy to use. And obviously it, it's an extension to Apple Photos. So you have to do it on a desktop Mac. Right, the price of this is insanely cheap. An 8x8 eight eight inch square soft cover book for 20 pages is going to cost you $9.99. So it's very, very cheap, £9.99. I think it works out around 8 or $9. The amazing thing is that Motif gave me a code that you can use until September 2019. And the code is going to give you 40% off this price. So you can get an eight by eight inch square soft cover book for five pounds 49 pence. It's an amazing unbeatable price. And if you want to upgrade for a hardcover finish, you can get that for 10 pounds 79 pence with the discount. Number seven is Presto Photo. They are an American company, a smaller company, but they have a vast, vast range of photo books. They do all kinds of photo books, lay flat, soft cover, hard cover. They have so many sizes. I think they have the biggest size range of all the photo books I've um, encountered so far. And they started making Apple substitutes as well, just like Motif. They were not the official supplier of Apple, but their books are just as great and they are almost completely identical. So that's the uh, book I created from Apple Photos and Presto Photo printed it out for me. So as you can see, this was um, from, this was made in Apple Photos and then all I had to do was um, upload the PDF and they printed it out for me. So it looks completely identical, the same paper stock, the same binding, the dust jacket, the matte finish. So if you want an Apple book, it's a great choice. 
and they are the only company who can give you an Apple photo book in a lay flat finish. So this was created in Apple Photos as well, but I printed it out as a seamless lay flat book. And if you want to get a lay flat book from your Apple designs, you can't get that with Motif or Mimeo. So you have to go for Presto Photo because they are the only ones who do it at the moment. Obviously this is more than $20, but the thing you can get for $20 is you can get an eight by eight inch 20 page soft cover book. So that size, but in a soft cover and it's going to be 20 pages long, 120 silk paper. So the standard photo paper and it's going to cost you $10.99. So it's very, very cheap. It's very affordable and it's a really good quality book for the price that you pay. And if you want to upgrade for $19.99, you can get a hardcover version like this one and that's still going to be in your $20 budget. Number eight is Blurb. Again, Blurb like Mixbook, I talked about it so many times. The difference between Blurb and Mixbook is that Blurb started off as a self-publishing company who did photo books as well. So their focus is still on self-publishing. You can create photo books or any kind of books and you can sell them on their platform or Amazon and make money of it. They obviously have a photo book range. It's a little bit more concise than the Mixbook or Presto photo book range but it's unbeatable in price. So this book is a soft cover, standard, perfect bound book. And this one in this, in this size, which is seven by seven inches for 20 pages is going to be $14.99. Just like Mixbook, Blurb also offers weekly deals. So you can get 35% off this price. So what you really have to pay is $9.79 for a 20 page soft cover book. If you want to upgrade for a hardcover version, it's going to be $19.49, so you can still fit into your $20 budget. To my knowledge, Blurb is the only photo book company which is going to allow you to print a book which is longer than 400 pages. I think the maximum is 440 pages. So if you want a really long photo book, then Blurb is your choice. This one is 200 pages and you can see it looks amazing. It's very, very good colors. And uh, this one is a shinier paper upgrade, so it's not the standard, but it's very, very cheap, even the upgrade. You have quite a few sizes to choose from and lots of editing options. They have an online editor, they have an offline editor, they have an app, they have plugins for Adobe InDesign, Adobe Photoshop. So even if you are a pro and you want to use Adobe InDesign, you can have the templates from Blurb and um, create your book offline and then upload it and have your books printed. Number nine is Colorland. Colorland is a European company. They have a very nice niche photo book range. They give them names. They have the classic, the exclusive and the luxury album. The classic is your standard hardcover photo book, which comes with lovely glossy pages. It's a digital book. It's a perfect bound book. That's how it looks. Now these are the designs from the actual uh, Colorland editor. I think they look really, really good. It's um, probably up there with Mixbook. It was one of my favorite editors besides the Mixbook editor. Uh, very, very easy to use, very many templates and they all looked really good. I just had to drag and drop and the book was done in less than 10 minutes. By description, this book is the same as all my other Perfect Bound digital books, but for some reason when I opened it, it just felt like it's a little bit better. I don't know what they use or what, what made the difference, but, but when I paged it, the paper seemed a little bit higher quality. The print looked really good to my eyes. Now, Colorland was very kind to offer me a discount code. Use the code GURUBOOK and you can get an A4 size 110 page book, hardcover digital book, for only 13.95, 13 pounds and 95 pence. This is an 80% discount and you can use it until the 24th of August. Last but not least is number 10, which is Shutterfly. Shutterfly is again, one of the biggest companies in the world. I don't have to introduce it to anybody, but if I do need to, then it's an American company similarly to Mixbook. They have a really big photo book range. They have slightly more variations because they do flush mount books as well now, but basically it's like Mixbook's brother. So they have the same range, the same style, even the website is very similar and the editor is just as amazing. They have some of the best themes there. The only difference is that Shutterfly is going to charge you for some of their themes. 
So the themes which you'll see here, which are called storytelling themes, they are the nicest ones like this one here. You have to pay $5.99 to use them, which I think is a little bit silly, but uh, if you do the book completely from scratch, then obviously you don't have to pay to use the editor. But anyway, the book you can get for under $20 is going to be an eight by eight inch, so this size, soft cover 20 page digital book on a standard silky paper and it's going to cost you $19.99 but similarly to Mixbook Shutterfly has uh, weekly deals as well so after applying the deal it's going to cost you $11.99 so an 8 by 8 inch 20 page soft cover book is going to be $11.99 so the price is really really good and even if you upgrade for a hardcover like this one here the price is still going to be under $20. It's going to be $17.99. That's it. So these are my 10 choices for the best photo books under $20. As you can see, some of them are concept books. Some of them are um, Apple substitutes. Some of them are series books. They are all a little bit different. Uh, the quality is very similar across the range. So they're mostly all digital books apart from Adorama Picks. I really, really wanted to include Zeno here, the little black book, because it was one of my favorites. However, the price has been increased to $30 recently. It used to be $10 for many, many years. And for $10, I think it's one of the best quality photo books that you can ever get. But unfortunately, the price is $30 now. They might reduce it again in the future to $10 or $15 and then I'll do another post but it's something definitely to check out so think of it as a as a bonus mention Zeno's little black book once again delivery was not included in these prices because it really depends on where you live and how many books you're going to order and how fast you want to get them if you um, want to find out the latest voucher codes for Mixbook, um, Shutterfly, Blurb, etc., go on to the deal section of my blog, thephotobegroup.com slash deals, and I always have the latest coupon codes for all the companies that I reviewed in the past. If you have any questions about this list or any of the books, leave them in the comments section. I try to answer them. If you think I missed something that should really be on the list, again, add it in the comments section so others can see it too. Give me ideas on what top fives you would like to see in the future. Thank you very much for watching and as always, subscribe for more.